Hey friends, Her Weekend Crafts is back with a DIY Rakhi video in few minutes. I hope all the sisters out there would be in search of Rakhis as the festival of Raksha Bandhan is round the corner. So I thought why not make a Rakhi on my own and upload the video for all of you as well. So let's start making the Rakhis all by ourselves in just few minutes. For the first rakhi, take the gota of small size, apply the glue using hot glue gun and then stick the rakhi top above the gota. Then take a small card stock and stick it to the back of the gota. Take a string Cut in the length of about the wrist. Take a white thin paper of the same size of the card stock. Fix the string on the back of the rakhi using the hot glue and the thin paper. Press enough so that the string is fixed to the rakhi. And here we are ready with our first rakhi. For the second rakhi, I am using a slightly bigger gota and rakhi top with a different design pattern. Follow the same process as of the first rakhi step by step to make the second rakhi. As we are done with two rakhi designs, Next step is attaching the tassels to them, for which we would need the silk thread and a credit card. Start wrapping the thread around the card as shown. Then take multiple silk threads together and tie the thread on the card on both the ends. Cut the silk thread on the card from the middle as shown so that we get two separate pieces. Now take the rakhi strings end and put it inside the tassel. Start wrapping the silk thread over the tassel as shown so that the rakhi string and the tassel are fixed together. Next is cut the extra threads from the bottom of the tassel. Follow the same on the other side of the rakhi as well. And the same is to be followed for the second rakhi. For the third rakhi design, I am using a peacock bead with many other small to large beads and a cotton thread which may be of any color you like. Take the cotton thread and start putting the beads into it as shown. Make the tassels for this rakhi as well and attach them. Final step is to put the knots on both the sides of the beads on the thread keeping the beads in the center 
so that the beads don't move around the thread. I hope you like the video and you will try these rakis for your brothers too. Thanks for watching.